Well, one of the common missteps that we see, and it has nothing to do directly with 1071, but it will soon have a lot to do with 1071, is we see the warning shots that the CFPB has now formally put in writing and handed to all of you. And that is that there's oftentimes a lack of denied or a high approval rate associated with non-consumer or commercial applications. We see all kinds of commercial loans that are made. Hey, they're not hard to find. But when we go to the adverse action notices, the denied, uh, the withdrawn, the incomplete, and I'm getting a little ahead of myself here, but specifically denials, okay, where, where we slam the door shut and tell them no, they're few and far between. And that's why we're going to have the discussion we have here today. That's not, there's nothing changing here. And yet you might encounter this during your implementation. Well, when did that change? Okay, we've never done it that way before. It's very likely that we haven't been doing, <clears throat> excuse me, that we haven't been doing it right all along. Okay, and we need to correct. Okay, and again, I'll tell you, our team sees it, okay, that there's a lack of denied applications when it comes to commercial applicants. Okay, and it's and the question is, well, so everybody gets a loan? I mean, everybody that applies gets a loan? That's, that's not true. That'd be silly, right? You certainly tell people, no, well, where's the documentation? More on that as we go.